Captive Portal identifies user information for web traffic, HTTP or HTTPS, that matches an authentication policy rule so users who are not logged into monitored domain servers can be identified. The Best Practice Assessment Check ensures Captive Portal is configured on internal zones. If user information for web traffic isn't available, the firewall redirects users to a captive portal that authenticates the user and creates user to IP address mapping or updates the existing mapping. Configuring Captive Portal on internal zones enables the firewall to learn user information and apply the right security policy to the traffic. Navigate to Policies Authentication. Click on Authentication Policy Rule and ensure that the Source Zone, Layer 3 Guest, Internal and Trust, and Destination Zones, HTTP and HTTPS, are identified. Finally, check the Actions tab to ensure an authentication enforcement, such as default web form, is selected so the firewall can create a user to IP address mapping. Ensuring internal zones pass through Captive Portal and enabling HTTP HTTPS services will ensure the best practice check result passes.